it'll kind of show. <laughs> so, <laughs> I I have fixed Ray Valtrick and Ray Luminor. I know it's been like a year since Speed Storm came out, but like I'm showing this right now because. So I thought, like, why not fix it? Okay. So what did I fix between these two baits? Yeah, baits. Now first off, I added a lot more weight to the, I guess like, this is supposed to be the chassis area. Or no, chassis, I guess? So what did I do different with Ray? Okay, so on these two ends right here, which were hollowed out, I just added more metal. You see, before, it was just plastic covered in like some metallic coat. It had no, uh, it had like barely any attack power, or like any good attack power at all. So I thought just adding metal in the hollowed out areas here would just make it good. And with, was it the Brave Ring? I just added like, it was supposed to be like this kind of hot glue mixed with like marker and paint to get the color right. The paint job isn't that well, but like it's it's all right. I tested these two out. They're actually pretty good. It just comes to show like how much mis potential uh, Hasbro has with Beyblade. These still would have been pretty good in their own system. Like this just kind of made me wish that happen. So, I'm gonna test these out. Oh wait, also, I forgot to say, there's like, I added like, I guess like hot glue here and here. That's because like, this has a lot of recoil with it. So adding like, some kind of burst stopper there helps. So I'm gonna test these out with like the regular kind of drivers. And then I'm gonna be using Evolution or Evolution or whatever it's supposed to be called on both of them with the wheel. Like the wheel uh, kind of this. So yeah, let's see them in battle. Okay, so let's do uh, Valtriac first. And this time we're gonna do it with Hyperion. By the way, I recolored my entire Hyperion for like top to, top to bottom. Wonder how you guys think about it. Like, I think it looks pretty cool. So now when you launch it. Oh, well it just has like rubber like material. Okay, so that was an example of it having like, or voucher having kind of like that rubber-like kind of material with it. It was just like hot glue and paint. <laughs> oh, it still gets dan- okay. So like the problem with this is that it gets damaged because like, it's being covered on top of like some kind of well it's like plastic if i have to fix it then i guess i'll fix it oh jeez oh my gosh okay so next up is achilles okay so this is gonna be Pretty good example. I still can't believe this is this is the bay that <laughs> gave me seven K views. I can't believe that. Okay, okay, it's kind of withstanding it. 
But like you can see like the re recoil. <laughs> the oh yeah. you can see the recoil Valtrix giving. Oh my gosh. It's too much. One more. Like oh my Oh. No. Well, I guess that was just, I guess, the height. Okay, now we have... Yeah, that doesn't really count. Like, jeez! Mm. And yeah, it still bursts. Yeah, you can, yeah, you can kind of see. You can kind of see, uh, the power it has. And it has the wheel. It has the wheel. Oh my gosh, it's self tailing What? Okay, that has to be the height then. One more. Right, I'll just move on. Okay, now we're moving up to Raid Luanor. So again with the recolors, uh, Helios. I think this is also a pretty good one, except for like, like the driver's obviously paint. Like this is mostly paint. Oh, what the heck. So next up is Mirage Fafnir. I remember Mirage was the one that always beats up Raid, but like most of the time, because it has not that much. But now it's the reverse. Mirage is like, well, the blade of Mirage had no problem because, well, it just, it had one problem. The good thing about it was that it had rubber, but it was too hard. But it still had the rubber compared to a later entry, Vanish. Okay, yeah. Yeah, it's doing, doing a lot better with the metal in it. Uh, I'll just move on. And now, I probably like one of my favorites, Dragon. Always. <laughs> it's always a favorite. Oh. oh. Bad example. Should launch Raid first then. Okay, it's probably gonna win because of the driver. I can't tell. But like... It's like kinda on par with it a bit. Except with the burst locks. Oh. Maybe it was too tough for this. So now we're gonna change the chip and everything else. Back with the surprise and chip.
of destroy, but it doesn't it doesn't have that much attack power with it too. It's too unbalanced. So yeah, that that's gonna be it. This was a pretty fun mod to do, honestly. <laughs> like it just kind of brings in what Hasbro would have or could have done to ba to these bays. And there's a lot more, actually. There's, I'm probably yeah, like, there's a few more that I'm gonna be doing with. Mainly, like, these two are also upgraded. I'll do a review on that. And also, a few quad drive bays have been upgraded too. If I can find the third one, <laughs> these guys, they all have gimmicks now. I guess this one too. And that one too. And so yeah, that's gonna be it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. See ya!